Hi Pixies, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Gigi, if you've never been here before, and I'm actually doing a Vlogmas this year. Well, I'm trying to post as much as possible, not exactly every single day, but you guys have been begging me for an updated hair routine, and I'm sorry I haven't done one in a while. I was feeling really uninspired by hair content and just feeling like it was getting really repetitive and I wasn't able to be super creative. So if you came here for my curly hair content, I'm sorry I stopped doing it. Um, but every now and then we'll do a little routine. First things first, I hopped out of the shower a little bit ago, but then I like put a hat on and now my hair is drying super flat. It is so, so important to style your hair when it's wet. So since mine is getting so dry, I'm gonna go wet it again and I'll be right back. Okay, my hair is a little bit wet, wetter than before at least. We're gonna start off with the Ceremonia Vitalizing Super Serum, the Perky Curl Activator. This is one of my favorite hair serums. It's really creamy, so I kind of use it as like my cream, but this actually has a good amount of hold to it, and you can even use it just on its own. It's supposed to like be able to replace gel, which is cool. Ceremonia is just one of my favorite hair brands as well. I actually have one of their like magazines sitting here on my little coffee table because it's so cute. And for my hair, it's super fine and can be weighed down super easily as you saw, like how it was basically straight after just putting a hat on it. It can get weighed down so easily. So I like to use creams that are really, really lightweight. Otherwise they just weigh down my hair. So we don't want that. This next product is the Living Proof Curl Defining Gel. This is my new favorite gel. Um, it's a new line of theirs. It is just so good. It's so lightweight. I take like a good amount. It's lightweight and it doesn't weigh my hair down, but it adds the best hold. It's just so good. It's so good. This does say it's for waves, curls, and coils. So this is a really good hair product for a lot of different types of hair, which is, good. Next, I like to go in with my Demon brush. I don't really do like my whole head. I just kind of go through and do like little sections. Basically just helps to define your curls and just make them really like kind of more uniform. So I'll do that and then I finger coil. Not everywhere, just certain pieces. I feel like this also just helps detangle the curl so that it doesn't dry like tangled, um, if that makes sense. I like to style up and away. Um, if you pull down, it's just gonna it's just gonna make your hair like super weighed down. If anybody else has this problem, but like in the winter time, I feel like my hair just gets so flat and just like it's like honestly like I would rather it be super humid out and have my hair be a little bit frizzy. Then in the winter time, what happens to my hair? In the winter time, it just like, I feel like my hair has just no life. It just feels dead and like flat and sad. Um, at least in the summertime, like the humidity just adds so much volume and like fun to your hair. Honestly guys, like this fall and winter, I discovered my love of hats. And it's been quite the struggle because I adore wearing hats but every time I wear a hat, it just ruins my hair. So it's like, if I wear a hat, I have to commit to either definitely like refreshing my hair the next day or just having bad hair for the week. So now we have this situation. Everything's basically as defined as it can be. Now I like to go in with just a little bit more gel. If you get one product for your curls and waves, gel, life-changing, like absolutely life-changing. This gel is the product that like helped me figure out how to do my hair. Anyway, I just like to seal it all in with one more really good scrunch. Okay, next you could use a microfiber towel or literally just any sort of like cottony t-shirt. This is a shirt that was stained and I can't get the stain out of, so now I just use it for my hair. <laughs> use one of these instead of a actual towel because because this is just more gentle on your hair. But anyway, I like to scrunch everything before I diffuse. I think it like helps everything be a little bit more sealed in and it helps my ringlets really come out and be more defined. Also just gets rid of excess water or product. Now I'm going to just diffuse. Everyone always asks me about my blow dryer. This is just a random blow dryer that I got in like seventh grade from Best Buy. And then I found this attachment for literally 10 bucks at Best Buy. So, <laughs> and I love it. 
I've tried more expensive ones and honestly I always just keep coming back to this so I don't think you need something super crazy and expensive um, but this like shape where it's like a cup is my favorite shape for a diffuser. I'm gonna flip my head over because I want my hair to dry as voluminously as possible. I'm going to first just blow dry around my roots and hover around everything else. So let's do it. If you're like me and you do struggle with kind of flatter hair in the winter, I highly suggest diffusing your hair. It is like the number one thing that helps me still achieve volume and um, okay now I'm gonna use this plump for joy. My hair is like probably I would say only like 60% dry but at this point I like to use the plump for joy thickening hair lifter. Um, I use about this much and I'm just gonna scrunch this into my hair. This is my holy grail product. Um, it really, really helps everything just dry so nicely. I feel like it helps the drying process speed up for some reason, I don't know how. And it also just like adds so much volume and plumpness, literally what it says to your hair. Somehow like your hair just like, it literally just plumps up with it. So my favorite product ever. For like 15 to 20 minutes and then I come back and I diffuse one last time so that's what I'm gonna do right now I am filming two other videos today so I'm gonna go get those ready right now while we wait and I'll be back in about 15 minutes well for you won't be that long I will not make you wait 15 minutes um, with me not here can you imagine if I was just like okay bye That'd be so mean. Okay, yeah, so, but I'll be right back. Three, two, one. Okay, okay, so I'm back. My hair is like basically dry. It's been air drying for about 20 minutes, 30 minutes now. Pixies, that is my updated hair routine. Um, I need to cut my bangs again. But honestly, I'm like kind of really trying to grow my hair out. I'm gonna go do that. Wow, you guys. It's probably the best my hair has looked in a long time because I actually like put in the time to do it today with you. But yeah, so. But yeah, so this is my hair routine when I actually do my hair. Um, I'm kind of, it's kind of like at an awkward length right now where it's not super long. Well, it's definitely not long, but it's also not super short. I think I've decided I'm gonna keep growing it out though. Um, kind of ready to have my longer hair back again. Short hair has been really fun and I know I'll do it again, but Ready for it to grow out a little bit. But yeah, I hope you pixies like this video. I hope if you are someone who has missed my curly content, you enjoyed this. I'm sorry I don't post as much anymore. But I thought Vlogmas was the perfect excuse to post a little bit. So yeah, I love you guys so, so, so much. And I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah.